what's going on guys welcome back to another video today i have a tip video for you it's a cover three beater um i'm pretty sure that i haven't seen this on youtube anywhere else i don't know why nobody's talking about it but um i'm going to show it to you here today so uh i am in the panthers playbook on offense and i'm not sure if this play is in any other playbook specifically um I didn't do my research, I just know it's in the Panthers playbook. Um, I know it's not a popular playbook, but with a hot route master or a wide receiver apprentice, you can really make some glitchy things happen out of it and make it a formidable playbook. So since it's a cover three beater, um, I'm just going to go over here on defense and go to big nickel over G and do that cover three since that's the one everybody likes to sit in all game. Um, and then under formation, I'm in gun bunch. Like I said, I'm in the Panthers playbook. and. Um, notice how who, who the receivers i have subbed in here um i tried to record this video yesterday uh, i don't guess the rosters were updated but uh i was able to have josh gordon and uh i was able to have josh gordon and demarius thomas and those are two faster receivers obviously but you know we got to deal with muhammad sanu and uh i put nikhil harry over here because he's faster than julian edelman by like a little bit um and then of course in the slot you want uh number 13 philip dorsett because he's got 95 speed you want your fastest receiver in that slot position because that's where the beater is gonna that's the player that's gonna get the ball um but yeah i'm in gun bunch and the and the play is called clear out fln so we're gonna choose that play um and right away when you look at the play art uh before we do any setups look at that fade route that r1 is running like notice how it's angled towards the sideline more like this is how this is how a normal fade is right it's just it's a fade but it's a streak like it's just, he's just running straight you know that's not what you want you want to leave the play stock you know reset the play that's what it should look like just leave that route there stock now as far as adjustments and whatnot you want to uh, first thing you want to do is max protect right so you have enough time that's if you don't know what, how to do that it's l1 up on the right stick blocks your running back and your tight end so you have plenty of time to throw and then the next thing you want to do and this is where having hot route master or wide receiver apprentice comes into play now um, now in order to get this thing to work you either need a quarterback with hot route master um, or you need to, uh, you need a quarterback and two wide receivers that have wide receiver apprentice you want your wide receiver one and your wide receiver two to have these abilities so um, that way you can make this play work uh, but yeah after that setup you want to put square on a drag so that you have a check down route uh, in case the beater is not open and then you want to click on circle triangle circle and you will put him on a corner out just like that and that's what the play looks like your beater is all set now as far as pass protection, you want to click L1, you want to double team um, this guy on the edge, and then you want to bring up ID the mic, and you want to ID that interior rusher right there. So, um, And then of course, last thing, you want to motion um, circle out a couple steps, and then hike the ball, and then just look absolutely wide open. So I'm going to do the setup again. I know it sounded like a lot, so I'm going to go over it one more time. Um, like I said, this is what the play looks like stock. You want to max protect, right, which is L1 up on the right stick. And then you want to put square on a drag, which is triangle, uh, square, and then down on the right stick, put some on a drag. And then you want to put circle on a corner route with either hot route master or wide receiver apprentice. Um, you, like I said, triangle, circle, his superstar routes come up you want to click corner route just like that and then of course double team id the mic you don't have to do that but it just ensures that you have the met the best protection possible uh to prevent like any insta sheds or anything like that and then last thing you do is motion this guy out a couple steps snap the ball kind of trot out here and boom touchdown it's just it's that easy now in regs, the only QB with Hot Route Master is Tom Brady, and that's why I'm using Tom Brady and the Patriots. Otherwise, the perf in order to maximize this this play or this offense in general, I think I'm going to do a series on this Gun Bunch offense with Hot Route Master because it gets there's some really glitchy stuff you can do with Hot Route Master, but 
what you really want is one of those golden ticket quarterbacks like whenever Lamar comes out this Thursday um, you could get that escape artist a hot route master combo of course you could go with Michael Vick Josh Allen or you know Cam when he eventually comes out but you want an escape artist with hot route master that's really what you want so um, you know that's that's what I'm gonna build my ultimate team towards I'm saving up for that Lamar Jackson so I could I could do this effectively but yeah like I said, I'm going to go over it one more time. Uh, max protect. Put square on a drag. Right? Put circle on a corner route. And then do your uh, protection. Double team an ID. And then you want to motion him out. Snap the ball. And just kind of try it out here. And then boom. Just angle that pass towards the sideline. He's just wide open. Now, how do you stop that? I'll show you how to stop it. What you need to do is uh you see this guy right here logan ryan he's biting on that corner out and that's what's getting that fade wide open so what you want to do is instead of having him in a deep third you want to put him in a wait a minute oh yeah double tap triangle select circle and you want to do um right on the right stick puts him in a deep half just like that now watch when i try to run this play and it's not going to be the same. Like I said, max protect, drag square, put circle on a corner route, and then set up your pass protection just like this, and then motion him out a couple steps and hike the ball. Now watch how he's guarding it now. He's staying with that thing the whole way. So, you know, but when he does that, when he does that, he is leaving open. Let me see, let me do this again. Put him in a deep half. Right, we're going to set our play up again the exact same way. Um, max protect, drag square, circle on a corner route, do our pass protection just like that. And if you have escape artist, this is where having escape artist and dashing dead eye comes into play. Um, if you have that golden ticket quarterback, if you're lucky enough to get your hands on it, you can do this right here. No, Tom Brady doesn't have escape artist, but see, look, corner out is wide open, right? He's leaving the corner wide open if he deep halves that. So he's going to have to pick and choose what he wants to guard. So that's why this play is so deadly. You could probably run this on somebody that didn't know no better. You could probably run it on them the entire game and they wouldn't know how to stop it unless they didn't run cover three or something like that, you know. And then, like, of course, of course, um, like, let's go ahead and set my play up again. Set it up the exact same way. If you're not feeling good about the, the beater, if you don't want to throw it, you can always just hit your drag underneath and just get, get your yards like that. So um, that's the play. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to start doing more tips like this, kind of help you guys out, make sure you're in tune with what I'm doing. Um, but yeah, that's the video. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next one.